I end up homeless through a, a breakdown of a relationship and a financial situation. Mm -hmm. I just couldn't afford to be there on my own and rent on my own. Um, so I went back to my parents' home, to the family home. I've been there for five years now, actually, this year. And who's there? There's myself, there's my two children, Chloe and Millie. There's mm -hmm. my lovely mammy who's in the audience over there. Good. Um, and my brother. My father was there, but he passed away three years ago, unfortunately. Okay. And day-to-day, um, -day, life wise Sinead, what's happening? It's, it's, it's hectic. It's crazy. Like, we're, we're all in one room, you know, and I'm not actually classed as homeless. Why not? I'm classed as the hidden homeless because I have a roof over my head. So I don't get the statistics that the homeless people get or that the people living in... Right emergency accommodation or hubs or B&Bs, I don't get those statistics. To put, we'll put some people say, well, she's grand, she's living with her mother, she yes. has the luxury of that. Yeah. And, and you say to them... No, I don't have the luxury. I don't have the luxury at all. You know, I have me in one room with my two children. That's for you sleep in the That's room with where, two girls? Yeah, and their ages are, just say? Eight and six. Eight and six. Three so, of you in the room. Yeah, there's three of us in a room. There's three of us sharing a wardrobe. There's two of us sharing a double bed. You know, there's three of us sharing, like tacks on the wall where you have to just hang up stuff because there is no space in left in the wardrobe to put anything. You know, it's not as if I can get a chest of drawers and put it in the room. I can't get three beds and put it in the room. There just is not the room to put three beds in the room. And the girls are going to get older and it's not yeah. sustainable and privacy yeah. and, and everything else. And especially for the eight-year-old because she's of that age now where she wants to have, you know, her private little box. She wants to have these posters on the wall of Justin Bieber and, you know, whoever the flavour of the month is at the time, you know, and I can't give that to her. You know, I can't give her that special place where she wants to put these secret things, which could be just perfume or, you know, makeup or nail varnish, whatever it is, but, you know, I can't even give her that one little bit of space to put this tiny little box that she can keep all her special little things in because I just don't have the room to do that. So